All right, I know I keep talking about brilliance, but I got I based on things that happened during the week, I got something I want to show regarding brilliance and brilliance and essentials, essentials. Eddie, can you switch to my computer, please? I think the keyboard shot was kind of fun. Well, it was, but um, uh -oh. There well, you go. Oh, that was my mouse. I did that last time, you remember? So what's the what do you have the adapter on there for? Because if I'm feeding into an old-fashioned HDMI uh, cable or somebody's old-fashioned USB stick, you need that. I need that. Old-fashioned. But, but we bought a really good cord, so I don't need this. And when you use it and you don't need it, apparently it doesn't like it. Yeah. So that's over there for now. Okay. All right. So sorry, Eddie. That was me again. I did that last time. That was that was fun. Maybe you'll maybe I'll learn something. About that that was that was a couple minutes of extra content. Yeah. Okay. So. In, Br in Brilliance Essentials, uh, one of my favorite people in my life, my sister, is making a pirate flag. How is your sister doing? I she's know. doing great. Okay, I don't completely, she, I should shut up. She has two thing. grandchildren, and she's got a new swing set coming, and she wants to make a pirate flag for the swing set. So she goes out, and she finds this little pirate-looking guy, yeah. and she goes, but it's too small. Can I make him bigger? And I said, yeah, you can. And can I make it bigger and not have the stitches be awful? And I go, yeah, you can. <laughs> do you have in Brilliance Essentials? Now, I know we can, some degree, we can yeah. do it on our machines. But I go, do you have in Brilliance Essentials? She goes, yes, I do. And she shows me to go, no, you have in Brilliance Basic. So send it up, because I'm a good sister. Send it to me. I'll do it for you. I'll send it back to you. But watch the show because I'm going to show you how easily you can do it yourself. Regardless. But she's not, but she's not on there right now. She I is. Say. She won't sign in because uh, she's like a lurker. Uh, she's just lurking. I would love her to get on here and like make I jokes think, about your kitten wrist. Yeah, yeah would, I know. That would she's make lurking my... in the background. I want to tell you that it is currently on sale for $139. I got their website right here. You can buy it direct from them. And if you don't like it, you get your money back in 90 days. So to me, it's a no-brainer. Yeah. It's easy breezy. Um, what I wanted to show you is how easy what she wanted to do was and what else she could do with it just by having this little $139 piece of software. So let me close this window down. Oh, I should shrink you completely. I'm going to go into Imbrilliance now. Now keep in mind, I have all of in brilliance not just what she wants this is what she want, wanted she Morning. wanted okay. thank you she wanted a pirate sign that would fit like in her 9 by 14 hoop and she wanted the last name Wizakirky on it and she wanted Wizakirky to curve I like that his was, hat I thought that was supposed to say Wiseacre oh she'll appreciate that <laughs> and she wanted I probably should have Fuzz that out. Sorry, teen. But she wants. She doesn't live around here, so we're safe. Um, she wanted it to curve like the hat, and I go, easy peasy. She goes, well, my pirate thing is only so big, and I said, well, you know what? That's a show. This is the kind of stuff I want people to see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to her originally purchased design, which is right here. And when I click on him, you'll see this is how it comes in. It comes in at. I'm going to round it off. Six six and a half inches by I gotta put my glasses by by six five and a half inches by six and a quarter. I'm rounding it off. That's kind of a tiny flag. It's not even close to what she wanted, right? Yeah, that's not gonna be very fearsome when you're sailing the high seas. But let me let me let me just show you something that makes this software so if you have an embroidery machine, oh my lord. Look at right down here at the current stitch count. See this? Fourteen thousand five hundred and twenty. <laughs> I gotta tell you a story. Can you see? Can you see that, Eddie? Can people see that? Because I can't see it. Um, watch what happens automatically with this okay. software. Okay, I was gonna, you're gonna hold off. I'm gonna hold off because it's a stitch count story. Remind me to tell you later. Automatically with this software, okay? I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna say, "Oh, she wanted it to be." I'm just making this up. This isn't exactly what she wanted. She wanted me to make it eight inches. Well, as soon as I make it eight inches, because this lock is on. It automatically keeps it in um, keeps the aspect ratio. Aspect ratio. Yes. So now he's grown up, but look at what happened automatically to the stitch count. Yep. 
it went up. On it went up to one eight eighteen thousand eight hundred and forty six stitches. This is going to stitch out as perfect as this size as it was at the little size. Likewise, let's say I wanted to make it a lot smaller because when she's done, she may want to make little matching t-shirts for her little bros. They put all they can and pocket. then all of a sudden you want it really small. I can change that and I say, oh, I only wanted two inches. Whoops, hit return. Whoops, I didn't, I didn't hit the return, obviously. There we go. Now he's really tiny. He's two by two and a quarter. See the stitches? 9,080. I don't have to even think. It automatically recalculates the stitches for you for 139 bucks. Now, so I've already told so you. You don't I, have to worry about density or any of that. It just no, does it all automatically. No, nice. automatically. And I also don't have to worry about, like, if I really wanted to. Now, she's making one pirate flag. I'm not sending stuff to an electronic cutter for one pirate flag. Yeah. But I've already shown you how easy it is to also click on those pieces that you want to cut. Make them applique position and send them to an electronic machine. Hey, well, if you're going to make that little tiny one, you'd want to put that on your electronic machine because that would be a pain to... Yeah, no, you can still trim around. Oh, depends okay. on how many I'm making. Well, yeah, but something that's you I guess you don't have big gorilla fingers, so... Yeah, it depends on how many. But so let's go back to the 8-inch because that's closer to what she was hoping. Now, I'm going to whoa, use my new trick of clicking down here to rotate my hoop. Wasn't that slick? And then I'm going to take this guy, and I'm going to rotate him because I want you to see how easy it is to put the lettering in this thing. Mm -hmm. Okay? This is not, this is step by step. If you do nothing else, this is, makes it worthwhile to me. So I'm going to rotate him in my hoop. See? Like that. Now what I want to do is I want to put a name in it. Is right, it Brent? Coming through on, oh. Right, Brent? It's not coming through. Oh. Oh. It hasn't been the whole time. Oh, no. Oh, I can go fix it real quick. So then this big A right here. Up here, guys, that's my text tool. So I'm going to click on my text tool, and I'm going to write, um, I'm going to write something different. I'm going to write Miss Muffet. Whoops, I forgot. I have to highlight over here. Comes in automatically as ABC. That's not what I want mine to say. I want it to say Miss Muffet. And I hit return, and I know it's a little hard to see, so I'm going to move it up. I'm going to try and move it up. I'm going to click just on my letters. Come on, letters. Move. i got a measuring tool. Is that coming off of the computer or off of your side? Oh, i got to go back to my arrow. Sorry, guys. There we go. Now, every... It's coming on. It just has the wrong camera on it. Every single letter comes in so you can negotiate letter by letter. That's what those green boxes are. That's not what I want to do. I just want to curve the whole thing to match his little hat. This is the beauty of this. Come over here. You see this little circle guy right here? I need to get a highlight, a mouse highlighter. This little circle thing means, look, can you bend him? Watch how easy this is, guys. See this top button here for radius? Watch what happens to my lettering. Did you see what happened? We're just playing with that radius. I can make him rounder. Do you see, do you, can you see it? Are you as mad as I am? And then I'm just inching him back in place. Do you see that? And then I say, oh, my T's a little lower than my M. So I can click on all my letters and I can rotate it just a tad. And this is basically what it, whoop, done. Custom size, custom lettering, ready to go. And I can also watch it stitch out. Let's watch it fast. Now, when you resize the whole thing, will it resize the lettering with it? Or did you just Yes, about it? if I had put the lettering in first. Yeah, okay. But I didn't. I waited till I got it the size I wanted to pick the lettering I wanted and get that curve right. Because yeah. the curve could change depending on when you're resizing it. So now what you're seeing is you're seeing this whole thing stitch out on your screen so you know where your appliques are. Come on. It's going. This is as fast as I can make it go, people. But, and I left the letters as last, so let's say she wants to make more than one and she wants to put different names in each thing. Just go in and change the letters. Mm -hmm. Nice. And here they so, come. Let me tell you my, my stitch count story real quick. Here it comes. Wait a minute. I got, I got to see the... This is it. Look at this, guys. It's just like that. It's done. Custom size, custom lettering... 
save it to your USB stick unless you have a wireless machine like the Luminaire. If you're, if you're like me, you just go up here. That's why I'm on my Luminaire. You go up to utility and you go send to Lumi. And you can give it a name. I'm not going to. I'm just going to, you'll be able to see up there for if all goes well. And it should. If Miss Muffet looks yep. like that. Go ahead. Look at, look at, uh, go in the, out of there and look at the pocket. You'll see it saved over there. Okay. And you'll see it 9 by 10. No distortion, guys. That's, it's 139 bucks. Mm -hmm. So what I've showed you already is how to create cut files. Uh, how to resize images. And you know, she can add images to one another. Like if she had another... I don't know, a dog that she wanted to add to this, she could. So there you go. Right there, there you go. Yep. You're right there. Yep. See it on the screen? Came over. Bada bing, bada boom, done. Bing, ba boom, ba boom. Nice. I know. I like it. I know. You're welcome, Tina. You're welcome. And now it's on film so she can be watching yes. again and again over and again. And, and know how to do something that a lot of people want to do. Yeah. And, they and, just, that's a, and that's a... They get starstruck. I forget how to do it. Well, guess yeah. what? You just got step by step how to do it. Yep. Yep. That's it. Cool. Yeah. Nice. I'm so, done. So anyway, somebody called me up and they're they're selling okay. their they're selling their luminaire. Um and, and she found somebody's gonna buy it, so she called me up, you know, the lady that was gonna buy it had all sorts of questions, so she's got me on the phone to make sure everything was fine. I'm like, that's cool. And um she told me the price and my jaw dropped and I told her immediately that if she doesn't buy it, to call me so because I know somebody that will. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. the only issue, high stitch count. High it stitch it count. had about thirty five million stitches on it. Mm. Not um, it's mostly but the person the, the that was looking at it, the, the the person that was looking at it decided to pass on it because the stitch count was too high, and she and so when asked, well, what do you think a reasonable stitch count would be? She's like, well, you know, I wouldn't want anything above two thousand. Two thousand stitches. Yes. That's one design. You just saw I had twenty-one. Yes, See, I added lettering, yes. so now I'm at twenty-one. Or even twenty thousand stitches. You're still that's. That's nothing. That's that's just test driving. Yeah. So as just as a hint, if you're looking at sewing at, at brother machines, thirty five million stitches, it's been used. I'm not saying it, that, yeah, that, it that has that's been not used. a low count, but that's it's it's, it's in its midlife. Right. right. Um, Twenty million stitches is when the maintenance light comes on. Just keep that in mind. Yeah. If you do nothing to your machine except vacuum it out and oil, you know, vacuum it out again, and at twenty million stitches, you'll get a little man that pops up and says, "Time for service." Do you really? Yes, if I've you get never it. seen. I've that. only seen, I think, four machines actually have that happen. I've never seen that. Yeah, it, it, and mine runs every day. Yeah, it I, takes I can't have a coffee long, without my takes a long time to get there. <laughs> but twenty million stitches, the maintenance light will pop on. Wow! And if that happens, wow. call me. I'll tell you how to turn it off. Yeah. Or you can bring it in. We'll, you know, we'll sprinkle holy water on it and hit it with a brush and say but, it's. But fixed. truthfully, and then I know I'm off track a little bit. So little of it is mechanical. Yeah, it's all. The, the, just, I mean, we're way off track, but okay. the, I did have I a, I know, but I had a dream machine that came in with close to 60 million stitches on it. It's actually our classroom machine. It's got, you know. I bet it does work on the, uh, I'm sorry, Lynn. I bet you it will work on the Destiny. Yeah. The, the button thing. Oh, yeah, it, for sure it will. Well, yeah. It she went, messes up a lot. <laughs> sometimes it's not us. Sometimes it's not us. <laughs> it's always, it's always the machine. Yeah. I like to blame the machine. But it's always yeah. a machine. But anyway. Anyway, so that's that. That's that. Yeah. All right. Well, I thanks. guess that's everything. Yeah. Look at that. We kept it to 45 minutes. We did it. I don't know how. And Because we just, a lot we of did information. It. We did. We're doing it. We're doing it. Okay. okay. Well, I hope you have fun. Uh, get a chance to pray with them brilliance. Go yep. for it, guys. It does so much more, too. It really does. I've just been touching it. People ask how I do something. I'm like, hey, let me show you that. And likewise, I did want to say if anybody else has something else they want to see demonstrated, yep. let me know. Shoot us an email or put a comment. Yeah, let me know. So thanks for watching. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Shenanigans with Brent and Becky. We hope you all learned something today. Join us again next week at this same time for more enlightening, crafty information. So on and be excellent to each other. Uh,